says, I have an exaggerated fear of death. How do I cope with it as it hinders my day-to-day -day activities? We said this so many times that the fear of death can be positive and can be negative. The negative part of it is usually due to shaitan's whispers. Weakness of Iman, and it might be related to other factors as well. Why do we say that this is related to shaitan? Negative fear makes people stagnant, refru refusing to progress. It hinders them from doing a lot of things. So whenever they want to do something, they're afraid of death. So they don't do it. Whenever they want to earn and work, they're afraid of death. Whenever they want to plan something positive for the future, they're afraid of death. Such fear is from shaitan. And a believer, a true believer, does not fear the shaitan, nor the soldiers of shaitan, Rather, he fears Allah alone. Now, you ask yourself, is my fear of death going to stop me from dying? Mm, maybe, maybe, no, it's not going to stop you from dying. Because your death was predestined 50,000 years before Allah had created the universe. And this is why it's something which is done and over with. Whether you fear it or not, it's going to come at a designated time, not a minute early nor a minute late. So you come to think of it logically. Why then am I afraid? It's going to happen. So is my fear going to prevent it? No. Is my fear going to make me enjoy life? No. So who's benefiting from my fear? Shaitan. Satan. So you have to put this in your mind in order to overcome such a negative fear. On the other hand, there is a positive fear. And this fear is the one that drives us to excel. So I'm afraid of death. Why? Because I have many shortcomings and sins. What are you going to do about it? Well, my fear of death is driving me to repent. That's positive. It's driving me to do good deeds, to compensate for the bad deeds. That's even positive. It is making me not so attached to this dunya, to the money, to the wealth to the family, to the children, because I know I am about to depart them soon. So I have to invest in them to the best of my ability, giving charity to ongoing sadaqa, sadaqa jariya, to feed the poor, to take care of my children and upbring them in an Islamic way so that after my death, they make dua for me or maybe perform umrah or any of the likes. So this fear of death is a positive thing. It is driving me to excel and to progress. And this is how you should look at it, Afrin.